Hello friends and lurkers and welcome to episode 2 of Food Truck Simulator. Now if you remember the last episode, we literally just got ourselves on our feet, we redone our father's truck, we got it all repainted, new wheels, everything, new fridge, new fryer, and some jealous other food mother trucker came and burnt our garage down while we were sleeping and we barely made it out alive. So this is what's left. Um, so I'm guessing we now have to find another way to probably get another truck or somehow we, we did salvage our photo album. We made sure of that. Okay, you know how... I'm in. You should be able to see a new tab called decorations under the garage tab. Click on it. Oh yeah, you know how they always say like in the event of a fire, do not collect anything? The first thing we went for was the um, photo album. Right, so we Done. need... Now you can see all of the parts of your garage that can be customized. You should be able to clean all six garage parts with the money you have left. I'll try. God, I wish it only cost me $25 for a sofa and a table. This is really cheap. And I guess it has to be. We literally only done two jobs and then our whole life was up in smoke. In the workshop. Get our fuel tank back. Looks like it's all done. Starting to feel a bit better. I got one more thing for you in the meantime. What can I do? A side job. I know a guy who's looking for help. I have Ooh. informed him that you might be interested and he should call you. All right. Thank you, Clara. We'll be in touch. All right, so I've got a call from Luciano. Luciano. Hey. Ciao, it's Luciano. You must be the kid Clara told me all about. Yeah, hi. That's me. I've been told what happened. But life goes on, and you have to get on your feet. I got that, yes. You work fair, and I pay you fair. Sounds like a good deal, right? Sure. So, where do I start? First, let's deal with the paperwork. You need to send me a job request on your PC. All right. Okay. Um, so PC... A job called Jobs should be now available on your PC. Hey, it's a Luciano! And a Super Mario Tattoo! Believe it or not, my uncle's actually Italian, and I don't know a word of Italian. The only Italian I know is from the Predator vs. Alien movie, and it's La Luna del Cacciatore. Basically just means Hunter's Moon. Um, yep, so we're basically going to train with Luciano. Hey. Oh god, that looks delicious. Minus the pepperoni. Welcome to my small slice of the world, boy. Wow, not that small. You have a lot of equipment here. Ah, of course, because I serve almost anything you can imagine here. Mm -hmm. Looks like I'll have a lot of learning to do. For oh, sure. Yeah. Moreover, you will be able to start from the most beautiful thing. Which is? The Italian cuisine, of course. Oh, okay, I should have guessed that. Time to work. The first order is awaiting. See the oven at the end of the food truck? I think so. Use the red button to turn it on. Keep in mind that it's powered by gas. Oh. I needed the gas, so... It's there on. we go. Well done. I see you know something about food trucks. Saves me time explaining all the little things. That's right. I have some experience. Va bene. So, here you can see my beautiful oven. It's the only right place to bake pizza. Got it. 
Remember, an oven needs some time to get the right temperature. Don't open the oven if it's not necessary, or it will lose it. I'll keep that in mind. Now you need to take the pizza dough out of the fridge and spread it out on the assembly table. Okay, where can I find it? Each product is placed in a drawer suitable for the type of the kitchen it is used in. You can find pizza dough in the drawer called Italy. Uh, Luciano, the dough is on the table. What now? It is hard to handle the dough without good equipment. I left you a rolling pin. Take it out and get to work. Got it. Perfect. Okay. Now you need to roll all the dough evenly until it's thin enough. Keep up the pace, boy. It worked. So, it's time for the heart of every pizza. First of all, you need to add the tomato sauce into the sauce stand. Oh! Put away the pin first, man. It's done. There we go. I have left you a wooden spoon. Take it out. Now, you can use it to add the sauce to the dough. The sauce. Put on the sauce to the dough. Oh yeah, perfection, dough, baby. Don't forget to add a few pieces of cheese too. Okay. Pick up some mozzarella, cut it into four equal pieces, and add on top of the pizza. Oh damn! Put the spin away. Okay. Get my knife. And a four pieces, a one, a two, a three, and a four. And a five. And a six. And a seven. <laughs> that was more than four pieces, Luciano. Um, he wants one, two. Oh, he wa Oh, yeah, yeah, the guy wants four pieces. I do beg your pardon. One. Two. Three. Luciano. Four. I think I have everything. Now, take out the pizza peel. Prepared pizza can be only moved with the peel. Capisci? I'll keep that in mind. Great. There, we want something with a bit more beat. Right, so what else does he want? Take out a pizza peel. Okay. Time to bake our beauty. Can't wait to see it. Remember. When you make pizza, you need to keep your eyes on it. The temperature is high, so it can quickly turn into burnt charcoal. No worries, Luciano. I'll be vigilant. Did it work? Uh, yes. The oven is super hot. <laughs> charcoal. In the meantime, you can prepare the pizza box on the table. Okay. The pizza box. Oh, God, the man's are the fool. There we go. We need to put our treasure into the box. Done. Time to pack it into the bag and serve it? You read my mind. There you go, one margarita. There you go, please. And the first pizza is done. Amazing. This is so much more fun. Better than burgers, anyway. Excuse me, it was what you asked for. Not pretty much. Don't give me that attitude, now, sir. Let's see how you handle something more complicated. Keep going. This time you are doing it on your own. Right. So I have learned something because Oh. I thought I could put them on the tray. Maybe not. Right, so oh this is Americano. Adiamo Americano. I'm gonna put that one too near the wall. Oh no. No. Okay. Perfecto. Can I pick this up and move it? There we go. Okay. So we need mushroom, ham, pepperoni, and chili. Okay, I'm just gonna have to set this over here just now then, since 
I can't put it anywhere. Um, mushroom, that's probably... Oh, there we go. It's a mushroom. See, I thought you could do that. Right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to take some time since since this doesn't move because it's training, I've learned from the last time you can totally cheese it, so... And I know I'm cutting cheese. That was not intended. So now I can take this, gather them all up, and put them in here. And then what else does the person want? Ham slice. So, uh, let's take a ham stack, put it here. Uh, get our knife. Okay. Oh, what is this? An extra piece. Uh, pepperoni. Where is it? The pepperoni. Pepperoni sausage. I think everything gets cut like eight or nine times and then that's it. Like whether, whether it's actually like... Right, and chili. The chili. Oh no, open the drawer. See, we're getting prepared here, guys. Totally cheesing the game. Now, I think. Onions, uh, they're probably Americano. Yep, there's an onion. It means when it comes to cutting the pizzas, uh, uh, sorry, making the pizzas, we've already got everything prepared. Preparation is nine tenths of making a meal. And I just totally made that up, and you can probably tell. Right, so now. We can do this. So, they want one mozzarella. We've got one random mozzarella. I've already put it on. Um, a mushroom. Oh, Adiano. Uh, a ham slice. Pepperoni. Yep. A chili. Uh, do you know, I kind of wish it would spread out more because the pizza will look like literally come out looking like that. Uh, and an onion. It doesn't like melt or cook, it just stays weird like this. Right, and they want um, cr crunchy pizza dough. Damn, we've used half the gas already. Right, let's get the box. Okay, so there's raw. Baked, and then it goes to crunchy, I believe. 
and then probably Carcola. <laughs> Carcola. Hey, it's a part of the pizza. What happened here? I am so sorry for putting you through these accents. I really am. Good. Good. Well done, boy. Thanks a lot, Luciano. You'll have to handle the rest of the day yourself. Good luck. Thank you. How much do I owe you? Loads. Give me all of it. So I think I'll turn the oven off just now because we're not needing it. Ah, uh, this one wants a burger, so a well done burger. Where are his burgers? Uh, sauces. Yeah, his fridge isn't where we would normally be. Ah, there we go. A burger? Is his um, rolls in here? Yeah, they are. Excellente. So he wants well done. So let's just toast the bun. Uh, let's get the little box out. There we go. And he also wants cheese. Okay, well done. Uh, and a cheese slice. And the top. And we're done. Your order number three. Fabulous. And order number four. So it's a pizza. We turn this off. We save it the gas, you know? Right, so, let's get the dough. Tomato sauce, tomato sauce. There we go. And they want the mozzarella. Uh, pepperoni. Uh -huh. And raw bacon, so that's going to go on after it's cooked. Oh, you crazy person. Raw bacon? You're nuts. People really do that? And they want crunchy, so what does this person want? They want another two, right? I'll do that separately. I just don't want to get confused, because I've got plenty of time. Plenty of time. Just got a little sip of our rosé cider here, because we're classy. Too late, they want raw bacon. Oh, it meant just as in not cooked. Oh, damn. Oh, no, wait, surely. Oh, it's because I put it in the box. No.
You see what you're doing to me, game? Just because it was in the box. It's not too late. I, I could have just chucked that on there. That's so silly. Right. Mozzarella. Pepperoni. A ham slice. Right, and this time make sure just to put the bacon on when it's on the table and not in the box. But I may as well roll out these other two doughs while I'm here. Or I can at least get... I think you can only cook one pizza at a time, though, I'm pretty sure. So which, which one's... Mozzarella, onion, tomato, mushroom. Mozzarella. Mushroom. Nope. Tomato? Oh, I haven't even got any tomatoes. How is it too late to add of oh, you know, lady, you're getting it like this. If you put the bacon on when it goes into the oven it's not raw i'm sorry to tell you game but it's not raw gordon ramsay knows what raw is and that is not raw that's an absolute joke so in this game's mind, raw bacon is, um, yeah, and you just don't put it on a grill before it's cooked, so um, that makes it raw. So this one's this one's just baked. God, this is stressful, especially when it's not very clear. Raw bacon to me is uncooked bacon. Not put in an oven. Mozzarella. Pepperoni. Ham. And raw bacon, right? So let's see if this counts. And they want this crunchy, right? So let's get this pizza box out. Order five, there's one of your pizzas. Let's get the box out for the other one. This is getting cl close to the wire, isn't it? Mm. 
Alright, if you can let me move, yeah? Come on, come on! Right, so that's what raw bacon is. You just don't cook it on here now, first. As the job is finished, it's time to clean everything. Yes, no, we've still got this one, Luciano. Just the pizza as I wanted. Take out the brush from the oven from your tool wheel. Then you can start cleaning it thoroughly. Okay. Some of the pizza sauce. Mozzarella and the pepperoni, and that's all they want on the pizza. And it's just normal baked. Then we need to put this on because we want some fries. With two tomato ketchups. Right, so we need a pizza, a fry box, and a pizza box. We got this, we got this. Okay. One pizza ready. Can turn this off now. Now are our fries. They're cooked. Into the tub. And we want, um, double ketchup. One. Two. I hope that was two because I pushed it twice. Yes! Right, we can put this off now and it's time to clean everything. Good as new, you would never know such a mucky pup like me had been in here. Oh, it's this one. Yep. Oh, do you know I really hate the sound of metal scraping? Oh. Done, boss. Clean as a whistle. So, now it's time for the other devices. Clean everything you have used and you're done. There, done. Oh yeah, I use this as well. For like one burger. Perfect. So we got $125 total and $20.80, so 145 That's not bad for a day's work, you know? I'll take it. Right. Oh. Right, so back on the wheels. You did great, boy. Thanks, boss. By the way, I got the news from a trusted man that the guy who did this to you owns a garage in the residential area. Told you'd be interested. Nice to know. There is one more thing. Your food truck. It's totaled, right? Uh, yes. Yep. Luckily, I have a few unused trucks in stock. But that's a big favor, but I don't know if I can afford it right now. Don't worry about it now, boy. Someday, and the day may never come, I will call upon you to do a service for me. But until that day, accept this justice as a gift for your working at my restaurant. Uh, you saved my skin, boss. Oh, what? We, we get a new truck? Take a look at the Ooh. trucks and choose wisely. And, by the way, they all have a pizza oven and special containers in the drawers where you can add the ingredients slices. The same as in my truck. Wow. You are going to become a pizza yolo, my boy. So, that's how it is. Thanks, boss. From the bottom of my heart. Right, I still like this one with the big grill on the front. I like that one. Good choice. 
I hope you'll visit me again, boy. You can always count on a well-paying job here. Thank you. For everything, Luciano. Goodbye. So, now it's time to take care of the new truck. Yes. Come on, friends. We're back on the road. And I'm just, um, customization. Yeah. Layer. No, we, do you know, we're going back to the old one. We're not letting that creep make him, make him feel like he's, um... Look at you. Now we can get back on wheels. So, Luciano said residential area. Let's check it out. Every action has consequences, Dennis. Blue windows. Oh, yeah, we, we, oh, we need a giant pizza. Come on. I know it's $75, but holy hell. Oh, yes. You won't miss us coming down the street anyway, that's for sure. <laughs> right, lights. <coughs> nah, we don't want spooky lights. Right. So now that we've got our truck back, right, I think that's where we're going to end this episode, guys. That was such an interesting episode with Luciano, or Luciano. Um, he was good enough to give us a bloody truck, which we have decorated to look exactly like our old one, except we've got this amazing new pizza on top. And we've got a pizza oven. And he says we've got the drawers like he's got where you can store the stuff, so that means you could probably prep all your veg and everything first. But um, yeah, I, I really appreciate it if you're still here at the end of this video. I really hope you're enjoying this simulation content. I really am. Um, on the road to hopefully 1,500 subs by my birthday in June. So if you haven't already, please smash the subscribe button. And leave a comment, please. Let me know if you like these videos. Um, a like as well. It really does help the algorithm because if nobody likes or comments that YouTube just thinks I'm a dud. And I very, very, well, I very well may be, but um, you can at least tell me I'm a dud. <laughs> so I can maybe not be a dud in the next video. But yeah, thanks for your time. And um, yeah, I guess I will see you all in the next one. <laughs> Wow, wow, wow.